Chapter 3 Embracing Redemption As Lucas and his companions pressed onward in the realm between heaven and hell, they could feel the transformative power of their journey. The weight of their past mistakes began to lift, replaced by a newfound sense of hope and purpose. With each step, the souls moved closer to heaven, and the intensity of the burning depths of hell diminished. Those who were ankle or waist deep now found themselves only knee deep in the tormenting flames, while those who were eye level deep had their bodies gradually ascending toward the celestial realm. Lucas observed how the expressions on their faces shifted from agony to serenity, their features illuminated by the radiance of heaven above. They had come so far from the moment they first arrived at this borderland, tormented by guilt and regret. As they reached the gates of heaven, a radiant light enveloped them, purging the last traces of darkness. Lucas felt a deep sense of peace wash over him, and he realized that this was not merely about escaping punishment. It was about growth, forgiveness, and embracing redemption. St. Peter greeted them once more, his smile now brighter than ever. Welcome, my dear souls. You have endured your journey with courage and determination. Lucas looked around at his companions, their faces beaming with newfound joy. We have learned so much about ourselves and each other, he said, his voice filled with gratitude. St. Peter nodded. Indeed, your experiences in this realm have allowed your souls to heal and grow. You have embraced the chance to seek redemption. Sarah, who had been waist deep in hell not so long ago, spoke with a sense of empowerment. We've discovered that redemption isn't about erasing the past, but about learning from it and becoming better. With a warm smile, St. Peter affirmed their insight. You have grasped the essence of this realm. It exists to guide souls toward transformation and renewal. As they stepped through the gates of heaven, the souls felt a profound sense of belonging. They were home, and the weight of their past no longer burdened them. They had found peace and redemption, and it was a testament to their resilience and the power of forgiveness. In the eternal embrace of heaven, Lucas and his companions were forever changed. They had journeyed through the depths of hell, but it was in the realm between light and darkness that they found the path to redemption. And so, their story became one of hope and renewal, a tale of souls who, though flawed, embraced their past, sought forgiveness, and ultimately found their place in the radiance of eternity. As their souls soared in the splendor of heaven, they knew that the transformative journey they had undertaken was not just for themselves. It was a testament to the power of redemption, a story that would inspire others for generations to come. And in that realm between heaven and hell, their souls shone brighter than ever before, eternally bathed in the light of redemption.